Hello everyone, thank you very much for being here today. Please before we start allow me to share this message with you. It's from Monica and really you just read it. It's pretty respectful. Thank you very much for giving us this incredible chance Monica. Also, if you will continue playing Cafe Land, I think it would be a not bad idea to replace the groups that we already joined with Monica group as it already shows what we want. Last week we said that we are going to announce something that is very important, something that is presented from us to the community and it was supposed to happen one day or two days after the last video but we decided to instead of making the video a proposal video we just make it more like a status report where we actually show progression. To give you a small introduction about what I'm talking about we already spoke before about the option of searching for a replacement company for game goes a company that can make a game that entirely tailored for us and while we are doing that we took the time actually to check the companies but along the way Zynga came up and I'm sorry if I'm not pronouncing the name as it should then we started to feel a little bit curious about why actually did the company shut down cafe world in short and to save a lot of details you can call it something like like cost reduction decision we already saw that people of cafe world really wanted to play that game so much even that it was a successful game they just lost it and then we found out that actually Zenga announced another game only to see that it follows cafe world where they shut down the game as they like and actually that made me think about the previous experiences that i had with the development companies where they can really toy with us the way they like and here comes the idea idea that we decided to build a team of professional game developers and we make our own game this is a pretty nice idea we didn't want to show it in a video in the last week where we will just say let's build a team we decided to announce it right after we build the team thankfully right now we have a development manager with over 15 years of experience in that field also we have a developer that already worked on three titles before and we also have a junior developer we have level designer and the art and creative director will be someone that you know and i'm talking to you after our first official day working on our game on our game not our game this game is for the gamers it is made by a gamer and will always be for the gamer it will never be treated as an investment it is something that is made for us it is something that made by someone that already suffered from all of these companies that keep toying with the players without showing them respect howsoever and this is going to be a very good start for a new era for all of the gamers this is why we decided to name this team as hope from now on there will be weekly report that you as gamers receive on this youtube channel this is why the channel name will change to hope games also the same reports will be shared on the facebook page and we made a private group for you the gamers to directly communicate with the developers so if there is something that is made or being developed that you didn't like or there is something that you want to have in the game you directly communicate with the development team and i assure you that there will always be communication between the development team and the gamers through this group and next week we will show you a real progression of course it will not be the game you will not see the game I, I know that we as gamers we understand that games take time to be developed and yes our team is small but it's big with care so I have incredibly high hopes for our game and yeah it is our game and will always always stay like this it is our home and it is everything that we wish for it's our hope the links for the page and the group will be in the comment section below. Please give us the chance to have you with us. Let's build this game all together. Let's make it the way we like. Next week, we will share with you the game scope so we all get to imagine and understand how the game is planned to be released. And the game will never stay as is after release. No, releasing the game like this is just the first stage and after this stage it will be never ending development curve for that game it will never end it will be the model that shows all of the development companies how they should respect the gamers and of course i think they never thought 
that gamers will ever be the competition yeah we are the competition and we are the hope for gamers we are thank you very much for supporting us until this moment thank you very much for allowing us to be a part of you and let's take the next step together